sad. This is... I shouldn't have done it. I didn't do it. It wasn't me. I was innocent. Well, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do Charlene. I thought this is one of, my, yeah, one of my favorite songs. And it's been my most successful song uh, because it was real. It was a real story and real moment. And I think uh, I just bled all over it. <laughs> so we're going to do Charlene. Yeah. Then we're going to do Take Shots of EJ. <laughs> I'm off after this. <laughs> Is there a house? 
heart in the house tonight? Is there a heart in the house tonight? Put your hands together. 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 Is there a heart in the house tonight? Is there a heart in the house tonight? Why don't you give it up? Stand up. Stand up. Okay, y'all. Hope everybody doing good. It's good to see y'all. Okay, yes, y'all. I'm gonna try to uh, screen share. It's gonna be my first time, so bear with me because I would like to share some of the faces of the missing children here in the state of Missouri. So. I am getting ready to go for it. Let's see. I would like to welcome Miss T. Mm. Let me get back up. Uh oh, let me cut that off first. That's going to be annoying. Andrea Albani, how you doing, my lane? <laughs> I saw Marco was up in here. <clears throat> Excuse me, y'all. I saw Marco was up in here. Who else is up in here? Okay. Okay, y'all, bear with me. Let me get in here. And I just ask if y'all let me know if y'all can see what I'm trying to share. Okay. So. Okay. okay, can y'all see that? Molly, <laughs> can y'all, Molly, can y'all see, can y'all see the screen when I'm trying to share? Andrea, you can see it? All right, yay. Okay, I did it. Okay, y'all, I'm gonna go over some of these names and these beautiful faces in here and, uh, you know, show some acknowledgement. And we have Sherry Nicole Barnes. Um, her current age is 33, and she was missing, went missing, January 7, 1987. And that is in the city of Missouri. Yeah, this is so sad. You know what? I, I could imagine their families sitting here, I mean, sitting there, depending on how many years they've been, they've been missing. And just wonder, like, you know, what would they look like? What would they be into today? You know, and and if it's a newborn baby, you know, what they sound like, you know, just all those those things we take for granted. You know what I mean? And to have that taken away from you, I just I can't even imagine it. I honestly can't. OK, I'm going to get back to the names here. Christina. Bishop, she went missing October 19th, 1994. And y'all, this is in conjunction with the Save Our Children movement that the Justice League have, our family has uh, currently going on. I just wanted to put that out there, you know, so those that wasn't aware of why I'm reading these names off. That's why we have a movement going on. Okay, uh, Christina was missing on October 19th, 1994. And she went missing in the city of Columbia. And also there's Peggy Alt. 
she went missing March 2nd, 1985. Wow, yeah, that's so long ago. I sit here and think about like, what was I doing in 1985? That's a long time to be missing someone that you love. Okay, and that location was in the city of High Ridge. Oh, y'all, these faces. Kelsey Berg went missing October 10th, 2017. So that was just last year, y'all. And that was in Florescent, Florescent, yeah, Missouri. And the age she was, uh, or is, I'm, I'm sorry, excuse me, the age they're showing is 14. And then we have Gina Brooks. She went missing August 5th, 1989. And her age today will be 42 in the city of Fredericktown. Mm. This is so sad. Christina Bishop. Uh, no, I'm sorry, y'all read her. I meant to get Chloe Cambre Rivas. I hope I'm saying it right or kind of close. Uh, she went missing March 15th, 2006. And that was right here in my city, y'all. Kansas City. Wow. 14, 14 years old. It's like, where are they? Where are they? Uh, Jennifer, <clears throat> excuse me, Jennifer Conroy. Um, her current age is 39. She went missing December 16th, 1993. And that's another one in my city, y'all. Kansas City. Wow. Then we have Raymond Dampier. I hope I'm saying that name right also. Uh, went missing November 22nd. Wow, y'all, that's my son's birthday, November 22nd. Oh, wow. Uh, 2012. And his age, 22 years old. Shamika Costly. Make okay, I'm sorry, y'all. I just looked over there at the chat. Okay, let me see if I can okay. Help y'all see these faces. Okay, so my eyes are off the chat and I'm just going through these names. Okay. Thomas Darnell. I hope y'all can see it. Can you see? Is that a little bit better? Ronnie Rena. Okay, pretty, pretty green eyes. Okay, that's another. Name. <laughs> okay, but what, was y'all able to see the faces a little better when I made it bigger? Did it show up bigger? Oh, wow. Yeah, I don't know what I just did. I just, I just do. Okay. 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 Let me get back over here and see. Okay, yes, y'all can see it. Okay. Okay, good. Okay. Next is Jane West Alton. Doe, y'all, they changed it to Doe. So she's like completely unidentified. Listen to something, look at that. Oh, wow, 1968. You know, it's like you just never give up, you know. That long ago, you'd be like, Phew. Like, you know, do you give up? But it's like you can't. 
Okay. Jane went missing February 1st, 1968 in the city of West Alton. I never heard of that city, y'all. Jane, another Jane Doe. Y'all see that? 1985. No age. Wow. Went missing October 26, 2013. The city of Dixon. Mm. Thomas Darnell Jr. We're missing August 22nd, 2007. And his current age is 27. I wonder what they mean, you know, with labeling it as endangered missing versus you know, just missing, like, what's the difference? I'm about to check into that. And Thomas went missing in the city of Hollister. Jane St. Louis, another doe, 1983. Wow, went missing. February 28th, 1983, in the city of St. Louis. That's like considered our sister city, St. Louis in Kansas City. They even made up some old sister stuff, but okay. Uh, John St. Louis, is that the same one? Yes, wait a minute, what? Wait a minute. No, this one we're missing 1992, this young man did of March. Is that the same one? Because that's in the same city. But like the first one I read off was 1983 and it has the racist black and then the one that we're missing, the John, oh, whoa, 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 I see it. Oh my goodness, it's Jane. We're missing in 83, John, okay. Okay, I overlooked that completely. Okay. So John went missing 1990, 1992 in the same city, St. Louis. Wow, okay. Yeah, maybe I need to put my glasses on. <laughs> oh, okay. Another unknown, and they have it, unknown Dixon Doe. Yeah, and that was just a few years ago. 2013, October, Dixon, Missouri. So what they did was they gave Dixon the name of the person, the kid or the person missing or child, the name of the city. Hold on, did they do that to the, hold on, let me go back. Yes. Did y'all catch that? Let me go back to the chat. I want to see if anybody caught that. Did anybody catch that? You see, with the ones that were those, they gave them the names of the city. Wow. Okay. That's something. Mm. Yeah, look at these faces. Let me blow it back up. Look at that. You know, and to think that one of your own picture could be just up on the screen. And I'm serious. I just, you know, I cry if it rains too long or if it's just too damn cloudy. You know, I basically, I just cry the drop of a dime. And I just, I cannot imagine something so tragic like this happening. I just couldn't. I wouldn't be able to handle it at all. At all. Okay, I'm going to read a few more names. Wow. Okay. 
Okay. Makisha Hopgood went missing January 29th, just this year, 2018. This young lady is 16 years old. What was she doing? What happened? It's like, what happened to all of them? What happened? You know, it's like everybody's not running away from home. You know what I mean? This is a lot of people. You know, what is happening? They just, I don't know. This is sad. It's a lot of kids. Lisa, <clears throat> excuse me, Lisa, or I was going to say, that sounds familiar. Lisa Irwin, this one right here, y'all. Uh, I remember this. This this case right here was all over the news. And they still haven't found this baby girl. She went missing October 3rd, 2011. Right today, she would be seven. Yeah. Because it's been a few years. I remember that one, that name. And um, like I said, that was here, Kansas City. And then Sherry Lynn Johnson, non-family abduction. I'm going to have to look this up. Okay, so that's kind of self-explanatory. Okay, no one from the fam family took her. Okay. But I want to know, I'm going to check it out and see what the difference is from those, uh, what was it? Yeah, please excuse my voice. I think I'm like either losing my voice or getting ready to get a sore throat, but I don't feel like a sore throat's coming on. Or it could be night air. <laughs> oh, yeah, like endangered missing. So missing, endangered missing. And... I'm going to pay attention to see if there's any more different labels there. How they label it. How about I unlabel it unwillingly? Like, who wants to get kidnapped? Who wants to get taken away? Um, Robin Ann Curry. Went missing April 5th, 1991, in the city of St. Louis. Jessica Ann Kenzie went missing December 26, 1995, in Union, Missouri. I mean, just some of these days, you know, I know people don't, a lot of people don't celebrate Christmas, but those that do, you know, you, you imagine your family waking up and like, you just celebrate, celebrated Christmas. And the next day, baby girl gone. It's like, wow. Okay. Mm. Heather Nicole, what is that? Colorn? Colorn? Miss St. July 15th, 1999, would be 31 years old in the city of St. Louis. Uh, Ashley Renee Martinez went missing July 6, 2004 in St. Joseph. Okay, y'all, that's a, that's north of me. North of Kansas City. Wow. Okay, Michael Lloyd Johnson. January 27th. No, I'm sorry, y'all, that was the month and day he was born he went missing november 10th 1974. he would be 44 today and he went missing in the city of independence okay this is just it's like overwhelming look at this I mean, that'd just be like the last picture that you would have of your family that went missing, gone. Where do they go? Where are they? Like, what happened, seriously? Oh. Sad. 
So how y'all feeling and doing tonight? Did y'all have a good Sunday? That's so sad. Yeah, and it's, I mean, don't you wonder? It's like, so they kidnap. Like, what is going through the abductor's mind? Like, are they just sitting there staring at them? Or is it just someone they've been checking out? Or just some spontaneous crazy shit? Like, oh, I just feel like, you know, taking a kid today. You know, like, what the hell goes on? It's like... Uh, I don't know. Hi, bless Grandma. My Lane, love you, lady. Nay, nay. Hi, nay, nay. <laughs> what? Oh, pretty green eyes, right? Rona Rena? Is that you, PG? Oh my voice, y'all. Excuse me. Yeah, they sick in the head. Yeah, it's sickening. I mean, it just it's like because I don't understand. Like, I've never just woke up and just said. You know, today is the day. I'm just going to do some crazy shit. But, you know, I do understand medical, you know, issues or illnesses. I don't know. It breaks my heart, though. So much craziness going on. Okay, for security reasons. Would that be from like YouTube? That's crazy. Yeah, I don't even, you know, no need to even say why. Okay. Yeah, I'm good. I'm about to end this. I just wanted, you know, to get on here and see if I can uh, get the screen share thing going. And I was able to do it, y'all. Uh, Chosen Queen, she so kindly sent me some information on how to get started, but I was so nervous. I was just nervous. I was like, okay. I didn't think I was going to do it. So I asked uh pretty green eyes to help me but um uh, we just got caught up in some live so i said well let me pull out what uh chosen queen sent me and see if i can go from there and do it without somebody like literally walking me through it but i did it <laughs> yay i did it hi boss lady what's going on with that False lady. What's wrong? Is it about the kids or something? False lady. Is it, what is it pertaining to? I chosen queen. Yes, I did it. Did you see it? I did it. <laughs> I was just thanking you. I because I told him you had um uh, I mentioned you sent me uh, the instructions to do it. But then I was tuning in to uh Pretty Green Eyes Live and she was actually going through it. It was late at night or early in the morning, however you want to put it. And then I started, you know, chatting with her. And we was going to do it that night, and we just decided to do it the next day. And then that's when we got caught up in some lives. So I said, well, let me pull out a queen, Sammy. But I called um, or emailed Pretty Green Eyes again tonight. But y'all forgot about the uh, spring ahead. 
after I mentioned it in in KPR's live last night in the chat, I mentioned like, hey, did y'all spring ahead? And then it didn't even dawn on me till after I sent the email late to her that um the time was wrong on my laptop, y'all. I feel so bad. Thanks, Vlog. Chosen Queen, I did it. I didn't think I'd be able to, but I did it. So that's exciting. Now I can start, you know, getting into other things. I got to take a step at a time. I really do. I work so much. I do. Oh, okay, Ronnie. Okay, I see now. You know, I've heard bits and pieces of it because I'm, I'm thinking you're talking about the one with the twins, the twin sisters, I think from Canada or something. And I don't know. I just, you know, listening to her speak and it just, I didn't have a... I don't know. It just I didn't have a feeling that it was true. I don't know. I haven't, you know, really gotten into that. So I really don't even want to speak about it because I don't know really what's going on. Oh, uh, but that okay, so it is them. Okay, yeah. Queen, I'm keep I'm gonna keep going at it. Like that was kind of fun doing that. It was like I feel like I was really doing something, you know. Or I just didn't have to focus on just running my mouth. <laughs> but it was okay. I'm excited for the next go around. You talking <laughs> flawless storms. <laughs> I'm wondering if I know what you're talking about in my head here. Chosen Queen, are you at work or you you are you at home tonight? That's what I, I thought you were talking about, Flop. <laughs> yeah. But it's just like, how dare him? You know, go and take people's personal information and just be a fraud with it. Like, you're an imposter. You're trying to impose on someone else. That's what you are. I mean, that's just a little ridiculous. Like, it's crazy shit. It really is. I don't think you want anyone to do that to you. And I'm for sure that no one in the family of the Justice League has done anything like that. It's just, it's really low. That's what it is. It's really pathetic that your grown ass would sit up here and just play with somebody's information like that. What right do you have to sit up there and just commit fraudulent acts? Like that shit is fraud because it ain't you. Anyway, enough with him. <laughs> Hi, Regina. So, yeah, I know it's late. And I succeeded with the screen sharing, and I'm, like, excited about it. So, with that being said... I'm a, uh, what's that? 
Oh, Quinn, you talking about with uh, changing the ID? That's something else. But anyway, y'all, I wanted to um, thank y'all for coming by. I just wanted to get on here and, you know, go for the screen sharing. And I did it. So I will be bringing more uh, screen sharing. Uh, share some more things with you guys. Yeah, we can read together. We're gonna um, we're gonna do some things. I'm excited about it. Well, y'all, yeah, I'm gonna get off here. Uh, it's late. Got to start a new week. We all do, right? <laughs> I'll be one of these days to blow by so the weather can hurry up and change. But anyway, I'm just sick of the cold. That's it. And it's kind of depressing. It depresses me when it's all cold and cloudy. My damn body don't want to be out in the cold. Damn bones start aching. It's like, oh, no. So Terry gets the nice weather. And that's a few of them that don't have to deal with it. But, yeah, I'm ready for it to be over. It's not like springtime. Everything just seemed like it's been, you know, dusted off. <laughs> like you just would have blew your flowers off or something. But I just love that air this spring brings. But, y'all, yeah, hope y'all have a good night. I love y'all. And I'm going to get off here and I'm going to see if... Uh, KPR still on and uh, hang out over there in the chat. But that's all I want to do is get up here and test the uh, screen sharing. I did it. I love y'all. Thanks for stopping by. Hope y'all have a good night, a wonderful week. Justice League for life. Hey, Chosen, we love you. Good night, y'all.